Good morning, love train. I'm awake, and today we got to go do some stuff because we got some birthdays coming up. So we need to go do some shopping. Um, so I'm going to go do that. And uh, I'm about ready to do my oil pulling treatment because I'm going to stay with it this time. And I'm going to be good at it. And then I'm going to do some video editing. I'm actually really like behind in videos right now because my computer, I took so much footage that my computer and my phone are full. And I'm having a hard time like finding space for it. I just need to get like a jump drive or something like that. But anyways, so I have that to deal with this morning. And then I got to go to work at 4 o'clock. And hopefully it's a better shift than yesterday. I think it will be. Nothing but good thoughts, you know. Um, yeah. That will be my day. Well, alright. So, um, we are scratching the idea of birthday shopping, at least for today, because I forgot. All the shops that I want to go to are probably closed today because it's the 4th of July. But there is an art fair going on in Nokomis, so we're going to go to Ryan and Scott's house and meet up with Ryan, and we're going to go to the art fair together, and it's going to be good. I've got my work clothes in hand so that I won't be late for work, and um, yeah, what a neat afternoon. Birthday shopping can be done tomorrow and Saturday, so that's what I'm planning on. <laughs> All right, here I am at Ryan and Scott's house. Look at their little summer setup. So cute. This is the most amazing house I've ever been in. We'll go through the garage, I guess. So I'm inside, just chit-chatting with Ryan, and he gave me a passion fruit to try off of his very own passion fruit tree. Let's take a look at that. I've never had a passion fruit before, so I'm gonna try it. Oh goodness. It looks crazy. It looks like, like weird corn. <laughs> All right, we'll try it. It looks crazy. Huh. I've never had one before. They're not super sweet. Mmm. I like it. It's good, right? It is good. It tastes kind of like an orange with like crunchy things in it. Yeah. I almost get kind of like a raspberry thing mm -hmm. too. Even though I think it's really like it's own like distinct flavor, it's yeah. kind of hard to describe. Oh, this whole thing out now. Oh yeah, I have a, I have a ton of them. The art fair in downtown Nokomis. I'm excited. We made tea even though it's like a hundred degrees outside. So drinking always, hot, tea. Drink hot tea. And I'm drinking it with a sock because <laughs> because Ryan insisted that I use this porcelain coffee cup that looks just like the little paper ones, from you know? York, from but the problem is that there's a design flaw in that it becomes unhandleable <laughs> when you put hot beverages in it. So I have to drink it with a sock around it. But Ryan assures me that it's clean, so. It's, yeah. <laughs> It'll cool down soon. But it's good, it's really good green tea. It's um Japanese. Like legit Japanese green tea. Oh yeah. Freaking yum. Y'all know how I love my green tea. Look at her 
to make yeah. these hula hoops. So you just take that, is it tape? It is tape. It sticks on there? It does. That is so cool. It goes from boring blue to like Magical. crazy metallic. Yeah. That's so awesome. pulling for my teeth with this um, coconut oil stuff right here well like it was really working like really well like it was really making my teeth feel really good and like dense and like solid and strong you know but for some unknown reason probably because I'm unorganized um, I stopped doing it and so, and my teeth are feeling a little bit funky this week. I don't really know what's going on. I can only attribute it to I'm 30 and I don't have dental insurance, so I don't go to the dentist. Um, so, like, despite what the naysayers might say or anything like that like there's a lot of people out there saying oh oil pulling doesn't really help your teeth but I'm telling you when I was doing it my teeth felt more solid and stronger and not as eh, as they do now or did before you know so I think it's important when concerning your health um you know, listen to the experts, of course, but also, like, do the things that, like, make you feel good, you know, like, if you can tell a difference, and it makes you feel good, and it's not, like, um, toxic, kind of, make you feel good, like, an addiction to drugs, or, like, that sort of thing, then go ahead and do it, so, I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep doing it here, let's just, get this open. I'm actually just gonna kind of drink it out of here because it's really hard to like spoon it out when it's a liquid like this. So, cheers! Mm -hmm. 